Simone, how are you? Simone Patton is an Army veteran, breast cancer survivor with congestive heart failure, asthma, among other chronic conditions. As a result, home grocery deliveries are essential to her survival. And I mean, I went, I went on Target, I went on Walmart, even Amazon Fresh was out of everything. And she's finding basic necessities increasingly hard to come by. Able bodied folks went into the stores and depleted the stores. They're out of certain things. Again, toilet paper. Because of the increasing demand for home delivery, Patton's anxiety is growing. What people have to understand is there are a lot of us all over this country who are homebound. The nonprofit Agency on Aging Area 4 oversees seven counties in our area. They explain this is uncharted territory. Right now, we're kind of at a crisis phase where everyone is just realizing that everything has to be done remotely. Adding that now, being neighborly is the equivalent of a lifeline. So don't be afraid to ask for help at this point. Um, and, and I'm hoping that people who are our neighbors are checking on their older adults in their area and making sure that there aren't things that they can help them with. As for Simone, she's finally getting a delivery tomorrow and will continue to remain at home. I mean, I'm used to staying inside my home. It's just, it can be a lonely situation sometimes. There is a quick response from grocers. Rayleigh's just hired 1,000 new employees and will begin training them this weekend. Food Jet, which provides the delivery service for Rayleigh's, is also quickly hiring. Amazon is adding 800 new positions in the Sacramento area alone. And Meals on Wheels is still providing food delivery services and accepting new clients. In Sacramento, Vicki Gonzalez, KCRA 3 News.